all got the chance to make it, right? That's David Naughton making it. And that's why he's introducing the job shop today, because uh, coming up, what can make it or break it in the job interview? This is a man who's hired hundreds of people here in Metro Detroit in the just the past year. And uh, his name is uh, Link Howard. He's the president and CEO of PowerLink Facilities Management. Tell me a little bit about PowerLink and all the things you do. Well, uh, thank you for inviting me, Murray. Uh, PowerLink provides facility services. That's building services for a number of clients. Uh, building services can be anything from engineering, housekeeping, uh, landscape, snow removal, uh, for uh, health care, uh, Henry Ford Health System, Carmano's Cancer Institute, Steelcase, any number of uh, industries. And Link, you give people a test before they even get in your place. They don't even know they're being tested, but they are. How does that work? Well, this is important information. Remember this one now. Thanks, Mary. Well, one of the things that we do is we make sure our process is not a process of inclusion. Our process is a process of exclusion. We try to exclude you from our hiring process. So we'll give you a test. We'll ask you to be there at a specific time. We'll ask you to not bring anyone with you. We would ask you to bring documents, for instance, your driver's license, your social security card. And if you don't do those things, we eliminate you from our process. So that's the test. That is absolutely the you test. You can't follow directions. You don't want them there. Exactly. You say you also look for passion. That that's one of the most important things after they pass that initial test. One of the things that's important to us is that certainly we want them to understand job knowledge. But because of the types of customers we have, passion is important to us now you can't teach people passion either they have it or they don't have it uh, we want people that are excited about the job excited about uh, engaging with our clients because if we're in healthcare care circumstances and situations we're dealing with people with illnesses people that are sick a smile on their face a person that's excited about what they do can actually help in the healing process and you look for people you tell me who do their homework what is that all about take a look at this doing your homework you say it's knowing the company knowing about the job and knowing about the skills how should I know about your company what how much do I need to tell you about that well when you come in for an interview one of the first things I'm going to ask you if I'm doing the interview or our people are doing the interview we're going to say what do you know about PowerLink you can go online and get information about us you can do research you can look at some of the articles that would let us know that you looked at uh, the company and you know the type of company you want to work for I don't know how someone can have passion about something they haven't done research about. Secondly, what is the job that you're applying for? I know people say that I can do anything and I'm willing to do anything, but have you done some research specifically on the type of job that you're applying for? So those things are extremely important to us, Murray. What about presentation? When I'm sitting there in the interview, the presentation part of it. We want uh, employees that are professional. You have to look professional. You have to act professional. You have to express yourself professionally because that's the image that we want our customers and our clients to have. And you talk about diversity in the workplace and in the hiring process. It's not only about ethnic background. It's not, that's part of it. That is part of it. Uh, that is certainly part of it. We want to reflect the, the, the client base that we serve, which is made up of people of every culture, every, every background. But but it's also a diversity of the type of jobs that we're, we're hiring for. We hire people in food service. We hire people for uh, uh, housekeeping. Uh, in addition to that, not only diversity, but flexibility is important. If you're used to working a nine to five job with weekends off, you're probably not going to be a fit for PowerLink because our customers work 24 hours a day and we have to staff those uh, positions for them. All right, you have a lot of jobs that are open. You hire a lot of people. Let's take a look at a couple of jobs that you brought us here in the Fox 2 Job Shop today. First of all, you're looking for a stationary engineer, a high or low pressure boiler operator license, basic steam plant operations, customer service oriented. What is this job? A lot of people have never heard of a stationary engineer. Well, it's one that uh, 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 looks after the uh, the boiler operations of a, a school. It's, it's a plant operator is what it boils down to. They monitor the systems. They uh, troubleshoot when things are going right and things are going right. They make sure that they have heat. They make sure that they have air. They make sure that they have the things that are necessary for the comfort of the building. Very important job, highly skilled job. Extra exactly, exactly. Uh, we look for people that have the necessary licenses and requirements, uh, certainly the Detroit certification to be able to perform those jobs. But in the 
school systems that they work in, not only is it uh, important for the comfort of the facility, but we look for them to engage the building and actually become the process owner for that building. All right, one more job that you brought, and I want to share it with everybody. It is a job for a housekeeper. Uh, take a look at it. Two years hotel or health care cleaning experience, ability to handle work independently, customer service oriented, floor care experience. Two years hotel or health care cleaning experience. I have to tell you, like, I've had emails from people who have been unable to find jobs in whatever they did before, and they said, I even applied for a housekeeper. No offense, housekeepers, but they said, I couldn't get it because I didn't have training and I didn't have skills and I didn't have experience. This tells us that that perception about housekeeping is out the window. Oh, absolutely. It this is. is a highly trained job. When you go to some of the clients that we serve, for instance, the hospitals, uh, People want employees at every level that can engage customers, and they can engage patients, they can engage family members. So a housekeeper is more than just someone that cleans a room. Uh, we want someone that understands the customer service mentality, that friendly smile, uh, the way you approach someone, the way you resolve a problem for them. So you learn those things in some of the industries that we look for people in. Final question, what do you see happening here in Metropolitan Detroit? You have your hand in so many different businesses and so many different industries, big ones like Henry Ford Health System, uh, Detroit Public Schools. What do you see happening out there? Well, we're really excited about uh, the opportunity that we have to uh, be a part of the, the rebirth that's happening in Detroit, the excitement, particularly in the new center area, the excitement of the uh, organizations that we serve in that particular vicinity that are hiring people. They're excited about doing things in the city of Detroit. We're a local success story, and they have engaged us uh, because of the types of quality of service that we provide. So we're really excited about what we see happening with the economy, but the perception that people are getting about Detroit in general. When I travel across the United States and people ask about uh, Detroit, you know, I can speak with a smile on my face and give some positive things about Detroit. All right. Thank you so much for being here with all that great information to help you. We have a link to PowerLink Facilities Management so you can learn more about the company, apply for those jobs and others that are going to open up at that company and elsewhere in Metro Detroit at myfoxdetroit.com in the job shop. Link Howard, thank you for being here. Thank you, Murray. And he will be back. Right now, we go over.